Introducing Hanaro Stand for Biliary. Hanaro Stand Biliary Uncovered. The flexible hook type structure with small cell space allows the stent to fit in any pathway of the biliary tract with no harm to the lumen and also minimizes shortening. Larger flare ends help to reduce the risk of migration. 12 radiopaque markers provide maximum visibility under fluoroscopy. This is the uncovered Hiller stent for clad skin tumors deployed in the format known as Y stenting or stent in stent. 2.5 cm wide flexible mesh is designed to allow easier access of the second stent. The second stent can be easily placed into the middle of Hiller stent via the radiopaque opening. This is the covered stent with two lassos for inverted removal. By pulling the long lasso, indicated by radiopaque marker, the stent will be inverted and safely removed. This is another cover stent with a special feature, a flap. Flaps are designed to reduce risk of migration and at the same time, the flaps need to be minimally invasive so that it allows easy stent removal. It features smooth inner surface with silicon covering designed to facilitate drainage of bile fluid. This is a delivery device for the Hanaro stent biliary. A black marker on the delivery device indicates the full deployment of the stent. A red marker indicates the recapturing limit, or point of no return. The locking system prevents accidental deployment during placement. A yellow marker indicates the proximal end of preloaded stent. A radiopaque ring aids excellent awareness of the deployment procedure through fluoroscope. Here are necessary tools for a stent procedure. Cannulation catheter, 20 cc injector, contrast medium, saline solution, 0.035 inch guide wire. Here is a short overview of biliary stenting. Insert the catheter through endoscope. Inject contrast medium. and check the lesion size through fluoroscope. Insert guide wire. Remove the catheter. Before introducing the stent, please choose the stent with a length at least 2 cm longer than the actual stricture. Now, take the delivery device out of package. Inject saline solution into the hole of delivery device to make sure that inner path of the delivery device is smooth and clear. Advance delivery device along the guide wire until the yellow marker is located from 1 to 1.5 cm beyond the duodenal papilla. Remember that the red marker indicates the point of no return and black marker indicates the end of deployment. Check the location of olive tip. You will also see the radiopaque ring through fluoroscope. Loosen the safety lock by turning it counterclockwise after checking the location of the stent. Hold the inner shaft handle firmly with one hand and then gently pull the outer sheath handle. Before pulling the outer sheath handle beyond red marker, the stent is always resheathable by pulling the outer sheath back till it passes the distal black marker. Check the endoscopic view of full deployment and drainage of bile fluid.
Here are tips for stent removal. Use a snare. Pull a long lasso and invert the stent. Or pull a short lasso.